I use this reverse mounted red dot finder in order to find Polaris. Now, some of these brackets are cheaply made. So what you want to make sure is that they are in fact true. Wrap it with a bit of tape. And that's to give this edge here a little bit more thickness so that it fits snugly between the wedge and the base of the next star mount. Take your red dot finder, take it off of the saddle, and loosen up these two screws, and then slide in the bracket and simply tighten it back up. There is a gap between where the next star mount sits and the wedge plate. Well, that is where we're going to place this red dot finder and bracket. So what you don't want to do is mount it like this. It has to be straight. Or if you want, exactly like this on the side. Take your wedge outside and do a normal polar alignment. Once you've done that first alignment, you want to adjust your red dot finder to position the red dot right over Polaris. Next time around, when you take your telescope and wedge out in the field and align your wedge so that the red dot finder is directly over Polaris, and you will have a very close approximation of polar alignment.